you're uh, one of our members uh, and were able to attend our Wednesday meeting, um, you know that this has been a very difficult and heavy week uh, in the life of our church. And so uh, if you are, um, I, I don't, a guest who has hung out with us for a long period of time, uh, you would identify this as your church home, although you uh, aren't a member. Um, I, I need to read a statement about the events of the last eight days, um, and it'll be heavy, and I don't know, some of you might not understand why we would do this, or um, so I want to create some space for it, uh, especially for our Fort Worth campus that uh, I, I know this will be so disorienting. Last week, we learned of a sin issue that has required the elders of the village church to make a sober and serious decision. Anthony Moore, our Fort Worth campus pastor, has committed grievous, immoral actions against another adult member that disqualify him as an elder and staff member based on the biblical text in 1 Timothy and Titus chapter 1. He has been removed from his role as a campus pastor and as a village elder due to these actions. Anthony acknowledged his sin when meeting with the Fort Worth elders and the three lead pastors of the Village Church, and we want to make it abundantly clear that we believe that he is unfit for ministry at this time, including speaking engagements at conferences or other churches. Our hope and desire is for him to walk in faithfulness and repentance. We believe he is in need of deep healing and strong counseling for an extended period of time. We do not plan on sharing any additional details about the nature of this sin issue at this time, although we completely understand the desire to know more. We believe we have a duty to protect the person who was directly sinned against in this situation as well as Anthony's family. 